15 marsupial mammals you probably did not know about. There are three groups of mammals, the monotremes, marsupials and placentals. Let's take a look at each one of them. The monotremes are ancient types of mammals that lay eggs and feed their babies with mother's milk, for example, platypus. The placentals are the type of mammals that develop their babies in the female's womb and gives birth to the offspring and later feed them with mother's milk. Example, humans, giraffes, horses, etc. The marsupials are mammals that give birth to underdeveloped babies which then climb to a pouch on the front of the mother's body. Inside it, the infant feeds on mother's milk and continues to grow until fully grown. For examples, kangaroos and wallabies. Simply, you can identify the marsupials as mammals that commonly bear a pouch such as kangaroos and koalas. So, are you excited to know about the other marsupial animals found in Australia? Let's go! Kangaroo these are of two types, red kangaroo and grey kangaroo. The red kangaroo is an iconic Australian animal of the arid zone and is the largest living marsupial in the world. Females have one baby at a time which at birth is the size of a jelly bean. The infant immediately climbs into its mother's pouch and gestation period is around 33 days. The young joy will permanently leave the pouch at around 235 days old. Tasmanian Devil It is the largest carnivorous marsupial in the world. They have stocky and muscular build, black fur and are capable of extreme speed and can climb trees and swim across rivers. They mate during March and April and typically give birth to and raise between 3 to 4 joys. Their pouch is at the back of their body. They are a endangered species. At number 3, we have koala. Sometimes mistakenly believed to be bears but they are actually marsupials. These are herbivorous and tree-dwelling arboreal mammals. Koalas have one baby per breeding season a year, but they don't all breed every year. Number 4. Numbat They are sometimes referred to as banded ant eaters, though their diet actually consists solely of termites. They are diurnal, that is, day active animals, and an endangered species of Australia. Numbats reproduce during January and February, typically birthing litters of four joys one time during this time frame. Number 5. Wallaby Wallabies somewhat resemble kangaroos but are smaller. Some can grow up to approximately 2 meters in length. They are able to breed the year round, so there is not a single breeding season. They typically give birth to only one joey at a time. Number 6. Wombat They are about 1 meter in length with small stubby tails, short legs and can weigh up to 80 pounds. They can mate at any time. Though most babies are born in the spring, they typically give birth to just one joey at a time. Their belly pouch is also located towards the back of the body. Number 7. Tree Kangaroo Tree kangaroos have several adaptations to an arboreal lifestyle. These are omnivorous animals. Of all the marsupials, they carry their baby in pouch for longest period of 246 to 275 days long and weaning occurs 87 to 240 days later. Number 8. Quokka These are also known as the short-tailed scrub wallaby. It is the size of a domestic cat and is a nocturnal animal. 
Quok cars have earned a reputation on the internet as the world's happiest animals and symbols of positivity due to their beaming smiles. Females give birth to a single baby called a joey. The joey lives in its mother's pouch for six months. Found on the bald and rottenest islands of Western Australia. Number 9. Spotted Quoll Quolls were once found throughout most of Australia, but they are not common anymore. Several kinds are endangered. They can grow to more than 4 feet long from nose through tail. Winter is their breeding season. Females can deliver up to 8 joeys in a litter. Number 10. Dunard Similar in appearance and size to a mouse, these are nocturnal animals. They can deliver litters up to 4 times each year. They can give birth to up to 5 joeys at a time which they carry in the pouch on the top of their bellies. Number 11. Kangaroo Rats These are nocturnal rodents and they hop in a similar manner to a much larger kangaroo. That is where their name comes from. The kangaroo rats are primarily seed eaters and they store seeds in pouches which are present in their cheeks. Number 12. The Marsupial Mole These are beautiful pinkish golden sand digging moles native to Australia. Their eyes are poorly developed and virtually hidden in the long silky golden fur. They burrow just beneath the soil surface hunting for grubs and earthworms. Their pouch is small but well developed and has evolved to face backwards so that it does not fill up with the sand. Number 13. Sugar Glider the sugar glider is characterized by its pair of gliding membranes known as patagia which extend from its forelegs to its hind legs. They typically deliver just one to two joeys at a time and are native to mainland Australia, New Guinea and certain Indonesian islands. They are also kept as pets. Number 14. Bandicoot Bandicoots are small to medium-sized marsupials with long noses and hunched backs. They are native to Australia and New Guinea. It takes around 12 days for a baby bandicoot to be ready to be born. This is the shortest time for any mammal. After being born, bandicoots spend around 8 to 10 weeks in their mother's pouch where they grow fur and open their eyes. Number 15 Opossum. They are known for using their tails to hang upside down from tree branches. Opossums can give birth to as many as 20 babies at a time. They are native to North America, Central America and South America. Sized of about a domestic cat, unlike other marsupials, opossums are not limited to Australia. When threatened or harmed, they will play possum, mimicking the appearance and smell of a sick or dead animal. Thank you so much for watching. Hope you guys had a wonderful time watching this video and I'll see you next time. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and also subscribe to this channel. You've been watching the marsupial mammals, kangaroo, donard, Numbat, Tree Kangaroo and Quokka. Stay tuned for more. Bye-bye.